next to the eye NPS 10. Back up your footage the easy way. Hi, I'm Johnny from Cinema 5D and I'm here with Stefan from Aspectra. How are you? I'm fantastic, thank you. It's been a great show. Happy for you, maybe also for us, but you know, it's just the middle. In any case, I want to talk about a new, actually it's not so new, or is it new? It's a storage new. device or backup device from uh, TV Logic and Nextdoor. I mean, they're now cooperating and this is the NPS 10. Here we are. What is it? It's a storage device so you can rapidly back up your files from a camera and it means you can have a very secure copy very quickly and you can then if you wish reuse the cards okay that was a real summary thanks for uh, no I'm joking we can continue of course um, how long has this been uh, in the market now we first started shipping these I think uh, middle of June they were shown at uh, NAB for the first time in, in April Okay. The thing is, somehow, I mean, I have one of those and I have to say I'm deeply impressed about the quality and how fast it works. And that's why actually I wanted to uh, interview you and talk about this device. Can you just give me the, the, the key highlights of this portable backup device? Okay, so it's a small, as you can see, hand portable device, dropping your camera bag very easily. Uh, it will take two SD cards, an SD micro card. You've got two um, USB slots at the bottom, one of which is USB-C for powering and for very fast copying. Uh, there are three different models, and that is down to the final slot on the top there. So you have a version for XQD, you have a version for CF, and one for CFast. Okay, please allow me to ask the questions as if I don't know the device. Okay. Will it only copy the material or also verify? It will copy and verify, so you have a number of copy modes when you uh, plug in a file. It will copy uh, in fast mode, copy and verify, or if you've um, put the same card in on a second occasion, you have the option to only copy new files. So nicely, it will, I mean nice, it will recognize what already has been copying or have been copying and then move on to the new files. Precisely, so that means that you don't have to re replace um, the original files. If you're short on time, it's another way of just saving some time. I'm sorry, just temporarily ask, uh, thank you guys. Um, now, let's move on to the, um, when you sell it, do you sell it already with SSD inside or you allow people to um, choose whatever they like, whatever size, capacity of SSD they want? No, we allow people to choose their own SSD, so whichever they think they can get the best deal on, whichever model they're most happy with. When we started advertising this, the largest, um, disk you could get in that thin size was two terabyte. Now we're already up to four terabyte and the machine is actually capable of supporting a much larger drive. I have to say that that was very easy just to choose and put inside the drive and also how fast it works, the copying itself and the battery life is quite impressive. I really I have to say. I do like also this rubber uh, casing that comes just around. This is not optional, that's part of the kit? It's part of the kit. Um, it's a little bit of extra protection and it also gives you an idea of which model you have because they're a slightly different shade of grey depending on which card you have at the top there. It can also play the footage. Will it do it with all formats because there's so many formats and codecs out there or it's still limited? There are a limited number of formats. I say limited, it's quite a wide range but it won't play absolutely everything. If you check the website, if you check the, the manuals, you'll find exactly which ones it will and won't handle. And if you talk to your local dealer, they should also be able to provide you with that information. But certainly most common files, more than happy with. Just uh, to explain, this little window here is actually a low-grade LCD that you can see the photos or the videos that you are taking. Also, in terms of operation, it's, everything is being operated with one button, am I right? That's right. It's a very simple uh, system. You have a button, a wheel at the side there, press and hold to turn it on, and then once the system is turned on, you either um, give a long press or a short press to select the next function and the wheel to move up and down the menus. Very, very simple, single-handed operation. Indeed. So please watch this space for a, a full review of this device. It's, it's simply easy to use and it's working. There is no other word. Um, how about pricing? Pricing, I think, is extremely good, 379 euros. You have to choose your own hard drive, but for what it does, it's a fabulous product, a great price. 
Stefan, thank you very much. Guys, thank you very much for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you.